Enemies. Those vile slime worms will taste our virtual steel. Oh, yeah? Well, bring it on, losers. And remember, the vanquished must submit to the humiliation of the vanquisher's choosing. <laughs> Just like last time, remember? How could we forget to made the school paper? <sighs> Never again! Let the bubbling begin! <laughs> Funny Sheriff Bindlewig! Look who's here, Mr. Cat! It's Mr. Cheeks! Teacher said I can look after him for the whole weekend! And if you want him to survive the weekend, I suggest you keep Mr. Cheeks and Mr. Cat as far apart as possible, Pumpkin. They're Mother Nature's natural born enemies, you know. Boosting mana for max damage? Fine casting to max repeat for instant narrow burn of 10 feet! Add mowing the lawn to that list, and I'll be a happy camper. Oh, there, there, there! I don't want you getting all wrapped up in one of these darn games and neglecting your chores. Not to mention your personal hygiene. Activate invisibility cloak! Thunder barriers! Secure the perimeter! Huh, secure the perimeter. Good idea. That's one way to avoid a catastrophe. There! Mr. Cheeks is as snug as a bug in a fortified rug. Now, let's go get the rest of his supplies from the car. Well played, my feline foe. Your cat-like reflexes more than compensate for your puny cat-like brain. <laughs> What's the matter, Kitty? Eons of inferior cat genetics got your tongue? <laughs> Need to beat you, losers! <laughs> Love while you still can, humans. Soon, your comeuppance will come up. Then you'll know the indignity of eating food pellets that look the same going in as they do coming out. Huh? It can be very confusing. <laughs> as you can see, we hamsters are much further advanced in the Earth invasion game than you and your furless kind. We are everywhere. Ensconced in homes and classrooms, biding our time until the word is given to wise up and turn this planet into our very own hamster ball. <laughs> but until the day of reckoning arrives, I shall get in a little practice by eradicating the one they call Minnie. Oh, who wants to have his widow head wobbed? Mr. Cheek, that's who. Oh, how she rubs me the wrong way. <laughs> You weak-minded feline. You actually have feelings for the girl. Oh, very well. In order to avoid any emotional outbursts, I will eliminate you first. Any last meows? Bad cat! Drop that hamster! Now! Silly Mr. Cheeks, you're not supposed to play with Mr. Cat. And how did you get out of your cage? <gasps> Uh-oh. Uh, Millie, did you know that your Greeny Girl Survival Skills Test is today? Today? I thought it was next week. Millie and I will be back in a couple of hours. Don't let anything happen to Mr. Cheeks while we're gone. And I want that lawn cut by the time I get back. Is that clear? Affirmative. Protocols locked and loaded. <laughs> Preparing to mow him down. <laughs> this is this bad bully cat. Oh, well. Until Millie returns and I smite the hand that feeds you, capping the cat will have to do. Grab the torpedoes! No prisoners! Greeny girls assemble! <laughs> no greeny girls, Millie! 
Just preening squirrels. Oh, no. They must have started the survival hike without me. Hurry, we have Whoa. to catch up. Too bad your life force isn't as strong as your stench. Surrender! Aza, Pooper Cooper. You would know a couple of real warriors if they jumped up and blew you to smithereens. Ah. 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 Ow! Uh, maybe we better slow down, Pumpkin. I think we might be a little lost. Maybe this is the survival test, Daddy. My fellow Zini girls want to see if I can get hope and lost and then find my way back to civilization without getting devoured by wild animals. Well, finding civilization and not being devoured would be nice. Then follow me. Whoa! Naughty kitten, you've soiled your oven mittens. Now you shall have to fly. and dark and scary, but no need to panic yet. Of course not, Daddy. The Greeny Girl Guide says if darkness replaces the light of day, light a fire to show the way. Ah, sounds great, but uh, better make it a big one, okay? though. Don't you worry, Pumpkin. We'll find you a perfectly perky replacement down at the pet store. I'm sure there's plenty more where Mr. Cheeks came from. We are everywhere. Everywhere! 
you may have trashed the house and lost Millie's hamster, but you did do a great job on the lawn. I did? <laughs> <laughs> In your face, second place. Smile, <laughs> well, ladies. This one's for the school paper. Wait, when do we get a hamster? Check this out! Atomic Jelly Drop! Yeah! <laughs> More like the Atomic Face Plant! Zero style points, cat boy! <laughs> <laughs> Hurt you, did he? Don't worry, Daddy's here. Is that Coop? Another broken skateboard? That's five this month. Uh, it's not my fault. It's. <laughs> Never mind. I solemnly swear not to let anything happen to the next one. Cause it's gonna have flaming skulls and this. Sorry, sport. No new board until you can show some responsibility. I can be responsible. Uh, how about if I help with Freeze! The... Drop the hoe and back away from the pumpkin! Ha! You call that a pumpkin? Looks like a pea! <laughs> you wanna see a giant? Just pop out your eyes on Omega Gorge! Hey, Dad, have you seen Mom? I warn you not to block the sunlight. How about a little side bet? The loser with the smallest pumpkin, who is you, most along for the winner, who is me, for one year. With these. You're on, Henry, and you'll be the one clipping my lawn. A Burton Burger has won the Bootsville Pumpkin Pandagroium every year since it started. And Burton Burger's Pride Excelsior Jaw Dropper III will continue the tradition. Tell him why, Coop. Because growing giant pumpkins is in the Burton Burger blood. Ah, get ready for a transfusion. You know, Dennis, holding up the family tradition is a huge responsibility. <laughs> you got that right, Coop. Way more responsibility than taking care of a new skateboard. You could say giant pumpkins are a giant responsibility. <laughs> okay, huh? I'll do it. Don't worry, Excelsior. You're in good hands. Hands? What? Who? You said show some responsibility, so now I'm showing it. Um, why don't you start with a pot of geranium or a... Uh, Something plastic. A good father would give the boy a chance. Be a good father. A good father. A good father. All right, Coop, you can help. Ah, fool you! You don't have a conscience! Victory is mine! Daddy, we have to go to the pet store. Mr. Cat needs a new toy. <laughs> Well, I was planning on going to the garden center to get some fertilizer for Excelsior. Why don't we pick up some catnip seeds? Growing our own would be a lot cheaper than buying new toys all the time. I'll see you soon, Excelsior! I hope... So, why the sudden pumpkin love? Excelsior isn't just a pumpkin, Dennis. He's a big, round, brand new skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> Fight mm -hmm. Burger! <gasps> the Bootsville Gardening Club! My Mrs. Your family history is history! My pumpkin is gonna crush your measly squash wannabe! This here sheep and yours a little strong for you, ain't it, sonny? And <laughs> <laughs> stay out of the garden center! Here! Now Mr. Cat will have all the catnip he could ever want! Yep, in about two or three weeks. <laughs> I'll just check on Excelsior to make sure he's... <gasps> he's gone? What? <laughs> what? 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 <sighs> and at the 
stroke of midnight, the pumpkin turned back into a princess. Pumpkin Buddy. Still night. Ugh. Darn thing must be broken. <sighs> no more nightmares. Excelsior's fine. Excelsior's fine. Excelsior's... Catnip! Coop! Help! Cat must have hit me with an alien shrink ray! Try alien growth ray, Dennis! Cat launched a giant catnip invasion! No fatal leaves off my pumpkin, you darn dirty weeds! Captain Nappy Noodle, secure the perimeter! I'm calling an emergency meeting of the Bootsville Gardening Club. Oops, forgot the club. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Captain Namby Doodle. This dastardly deed has Coop Burger written all over it. <laughs> Sounds like we're in the Amazon. Huh, we should have taken a left turn at Albuquerque. Give me a boost. Do you see Cat? Worse! It's the Bootsville Gardening Club. The Bootsburger boy is trying to smother our pumpkins. We're gonna smash this pumpkin to itty bitty pieces. Buddy, guess it is in your blood. Don't worry, I won't let them smash you. I'll get them so lost in the jungle they'll never come back. <laughs> Take it from here. You know, sometimes I wish I was round. Uh -oh. Where's that pumpkin of yours? Start the effort! King. Whoa! Little Excelsior's all grown up! <laughs> Mr. Cat? Excelsior? Am I still dreaming? <laughs> well, that should be enough catnip to last him for the rest of the year. Ugh. 
I don't know what to do with the rest of it. Must have been a super fast growing variety. That's the last of it. Thanks, Coop. I gotta say, you really did prove yourself. I don't know how you did it, but our pumpkin's the biggest. The Burton Burgers triumph again. You win this round, Burton Burger, but I'll get you next year. Next year, Burton Burger. Next year. <laughs> Here you go, sports. Whoa. You earned it. Awesome! Thanks, Dad. Promise I'll take good care of it. <laughs> Run, hot plate, dude! Totally. <laughs> and when you eat it on this ramp, <laughs> it's delicious. Thomas Kelly Drop! Pancake Pail Driver! Pitch Lobster! Pop! <laughs> 